Today we're out in the beautiful desert and we're going to do a little shooting. Today we are out with the Henry. It's had uh, home defense duty, which means it's been out in the open for a while. I'm going to make sure that the uh, sights are true and I'm still competent with it. We're going to shoot a little bit of paper and maybe uh, ding a little bit of steel. So today we're out with the Henry. It's uh, had home defense duty for quite a while. I wanted to make sure that the sights are still true and that um, I'm still proficient with it. So Henry lover action. I'm going to shoot a little bit of paper and then uh, maybe ring some steel with it. Um, also, out with a 40, and uh, it's my one of my EDC choices. Um, and uh, if we uh, get to it, maybe we'll uh, we'll get to shooting that too. So for you folks that are worried about my hearing, I am wearing um, earplugs. Not a huge fan of over-the-ear protection. However, I do use that sometimes, but just um, I do get comments when I do these videos, so just a uh, just an advisory note. go down and take a look. I think I got a little better grouping. After the first 10 rounds, I think I conditioned the barrel a little bit and I think uh, we got a nice group here. Here we go, right there. About a thumbnail size, I had a flyer up there, but uh, everything went right in here just about. That's kind of what I was looking for. That's about 20 yards there, so, um, I'll keep it a little bit high because I'd like to have a little bit more range on it. I kind of know where it's at and uh, really um, this is kind of where you need to be with it for, for home defense anyway. So we forgot one of the cameras today so no cool two camera shots. Uh, we're going to do a little AR500 steel versus a uh, 40 caliber Smith & Wesson.
So this is what a 357 Magnum hollow point round does to a full bottle of water. Shooting steel is dangerous. It has a risk to it. You want everything to be able to, you don't want anything solid, you want everything to swing, and you want to be back far enough, but you're still going to get hit sometimes with some shrapnel. So I'm not wearing gloves today, I really should be, but definitely eye protection and good heavy shirt or something like that because it got me in the ear. We got our stuff packed up we're ready to go appreciate you watching please comment subscribe ding that bell so you get notifications like and share adios